It's Entertainment Schmig. Yesterday, as we were getting off the show, I saw breaking news everywhere that Bobby Christina's family, Whitney Houston and Bobby Brown's daughter, uh, the family was told to say their goodbyes um, and that the end was near. Conflicting reports. Um, But in that report, they said that Bobby Brown is in denial and he said he's not ready to say goodbye yet. Well, yesterday was his birthday. So cut the man some slack I get if it. that is mm-hmm. the case. But he was stopped outside of the hospital as he was leaving in Atlanta yesterday by, I believe it was Access Hollywood. That's got to be a great job, right? Trolling outside the hospital, waiting to stick a camera in somebody's face as their daughter's dying. But uh, they asked Bobby Brown how Bobby Christina was doing, and he said, she's good. We're praying. That's all he said. So there are conflicting reports. Eerie, too, because this is Grammys weekend. And three years ago, the day before the Grammys, was when Whitney Houston was found dead in the Mm. bathtub. So maybe that has something to do with it, right? Do you want it to be on the same sort of anniversary Mm. the night before the Grammys? It's just... It's tragic. It's awful. More hospital news for you. Entertainment hospital news with Suge Knight. Okay, we haven't talked a whole lot about Suge Knight since we talked about how he ran over his friend, allegedly trying to run over another guy. He's a charmer. Yeah, he's a, he's a, I don't want to go to jail-itis is yeah. what he probably like, right. Right. When is this guy going to wind up behind bars? I know, so they arrest him, take him to jail, but then he complains of chest pains and goes to the hospital. Everyone's like, is he making it up? Well, no, he actually had a blood clot in his lungs. Oh. Which, by the way, came from, uh, they believe it stemmed from him Gun being shot. shot six times in the chest. Uh, yeah, last year. Uh, he's been discharged from the hospital, by the way. He is back in jail. But um, the 911 call has been released of this uh, fatal accident. The caller says, the car ran over two guys that was fighting, and then he just pulled back and pulled forward and run them over. Yeah, I didn't see the, the person, mm. is what he said. He's he had despicable. no idea he'd hit anyone. Yeah. Oof. Oof. Not good. Not good. I, w- I don't, wouldn't want to be there when the karma train pulls up to the station for Suge Knight. <laughs> you know what, though? I would not say any It'd of this. It'd be a drive-by train. <laughs> right. I would not say any of this if we were on the radio in L.A. because he does scare me a little. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> mm-hmm. This could get back to him. I would... <laughs> he, has, he has people, too. Am I wrong? No, no. you're no. right. Me, right. Man. No. no. Okay. He's got folks here, you know. Well, <laughs> that was Jen that said that. <laughs> Ida's line. (laughs) Right. (laughs) Jen Myers. (laughs) That's why I use a fake name. Uh, (laughs) Plus size model. We talked yesterday about how there's a plus size model featured in an ad in the Sports Illustrated swimsuit issue. Turns out there is an actual plus size model featured in the whole photo spread in SI swimsuit issue. First plus size model ever. And I was trying to think of her name yesterday. Her name is Robin Lawley. She's a size 10. I know. I'm going to. What? She's a size 10. When is that plus size? She looks awesome. She's gorgeous. She looks healthy. She looks like what every Elle, model should look like. She reminds me of Elle McPherson. She is like from the 80s yes. when women had curves sure. and yeah. they weren't mm-hmm. a zero like skeleton that most women, I'm sorry, no, if you dieted and exercised as much as you could, you wouldn't be able to attain like the supermodel body of today. Robin Lawley looks awesome. She has her own swimsuit line because... When she was doing uh, photo shoots and she would have to do a swimsuit, she used to have to put underwear on because they didn't make swimsuits above like a size six or an eight. So she decided, you know what, I'm just going to make my own swimwear line. And it's hugely successful now. It runs from like size eight to size 22 or something. It's really cool. You should follow her on Instagram because she posted some of the pictures from Sports Illustrated from the photo shoot. We have them up online now at Y98.com. Yeah, swimsuits are not made for boobs either, Mm -mm. unless they're fake boobs that can stand up on their own. I mean, you know what? There's nothing. There's no swimsuit. You have to get like a scoop. You don't understand. I don't, and uh, but I'm fascinated. <laughs> it's awful. I really, I'm, I, I like the way the scoop. You have the scoop, yeah. and then your boob hangs below the scoop, so it's like this weird boob, and then b- yes. below boob. Yep. We call it a boob scoop. <laughs> <laughs> Jupiter ascending the SpongeBob movie and Seventh Son in theaters this weekend. Next weekend, leave your whips at home. Fifty Shades of Grey, a lot of theaters will not allow you to bring um, 
<laughs> costumes or oh, I was, different uh, things. I just got a new cat o' nine tails. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, AMC <sighs> Theater said, while we welcome those guests who want to show excitement for a film by dressing up in costume, we do not permit weapons, real or fake. Oh, okay. No props. Imagine, you know, during the quiet parts of the movie. <laughs> you hear that like all over the theater. Uh, why would you bring a blender into a theater? That's weird. I know it's the magic weird. bullet. <laughs> oh, I think there's okay. one of those too. TV this weekend, the series finale of Red Band Society tomorrow night on Fox. <laughs> Sunday night. The Grammy Awards, LL Cool J hosts I Threw Up My TV it's Too great. with LL from like, I don't even want to say how many years ago, 15. Uh, Walking Dead returns on Sunday night, followed by the series premiere of the Breaking Bad spinoff, Better Call Saul. It's yeah, already in here. That. Looking forward to it. it, yeah. It's mm. going to be good. That is Entertainment Schmig. More at 840 and online at Y98.com.